Praise the Lord. Today we are going to describe Je Lord Jesus Christ in every book of Bible. In Genesis, Jesus Christ is bread of life. In Exodus, he is the Passover lamb. In Leviticus, he is a high priest. In Numbers, he is the pillar of cloud by day and the pillar of fire by night. In Deuteronomy, he is the prophet like unto Moses. In Joshua, he is the captain of our salvation. In Judges, he is our judge and the lawgiver. In Ruth, he is our kinsman redeemer. In 1st and 2nd Samuel, he is our trusted prophet. In Kings and Chronicles, he is our reigning king. In Ezra and Nehemiah, he is the rebuilder of the broken down walls of human life. In Esther, he is our Mordecai. In Job, he is our ever-living redeemer. In Psalms, he is our shepherd. In Proverbs and Ecclesiastes, he is our wisdom. In the Song of Solomon, he is our loving bridegroom. In Ashaya, he is the prince of peace. In Jeremiah, he is the righteous branch. In Levitation, he is our weeping prophet. In, uh, in Ezekiel, he is the in Ezekiel, he is the wonderful four-faced man. In Daniel, he is the fourth man in the fiery furnace. Uh, in Hosea, he is the faithful husband, forever married the black sliders. In Joel, he is the he is the baptized with the Holy Ghost and fire. In Amos, he is the burden bearer. In uh, in Obedia, he is the he is the mighty to save. In Jonah. He is the great foreign missionary. In Micah, he is the messenger of beautiful feet. In Nahum, he is the stronghold in the day of trouble. In Habakkuk, he is God's evangelist trying to revive thy work in the midst of the years. In Zephaniah, he is our savior. In Haggai, he is the restorer of God's lost heritage. In Zechariah, he is the fountain opened up in the house of David for sin and uncleanness. In Malachi, he is the son of righteousness, healing, rising with healing in his veins. In Matthew, Jesus Christ is king of the Jews. In Mark, he is the servant. In Luke, he is the son of man, feeling what you feel. In John, he is the son of God. In Acts, he is the savior of the world. In Romans, he is the righteousness of God. In 1 Corinthians, he is the rock that followed Israel. In 2 Corinthians, he is the triumphant one giving victory. In Galatians, <coughs> he, is, he is your liberty, he sets you free. In Ephesians, he is head of the church. In Philippians, he is, he is your joy. In Colossians, he is your completeness. In 1 and 2 Thessalonians, he is your hope. In, in 1 Timothy, he is your faith. In 2 Timothy, he is your stability. In Titus, he is true. In, <coughs> in Philemon, he is your benefactor. In, in Hebrews, he is your perfection. In James, he is the power behind your faith. In, in James, First in 1 Peter, he is your example. In 2 Peter, he is your purity. In first, in first John, he is your life. In second John, he is your pattern. In third John, he is your motivation. In Jude, he is foundation of your faith. In Revelation, he is your coming king. He is the first and the last, the beginning and the end. He are, he is he is keeper of creation and creator of all. He is the key, he is the architect of the universe and the manager of all time. He always works, he always is, and he always will be. Mm -hmm. Un unmoved, unchanged, mm -hmm. un undefeated, and never under. He was bruised, bruised and brought healing. He was pierced and eased pain. He was persecuted and brought Freedom. He was dead and brought life. He, he is risen and brings peace. Power. He, he is reigns and brings power. Peace. 
The world can't understand him. The armies can't defeat him. The school can't explain him. The leaders can't ignore him. People can't fool him. Hero couldn't kill him. He, Nero couldn't crush him. Hitler couldn't silence him. The new age can't. The new age can't replace him. He is. He is light, love, long, longevity, and Lord. He is goodness, kindness, gentleness, and God. He is holy, mighty, righteousness, powerful, and pure. His will is unchanging. His mind is on me. His will is. His will is unchanging. He is my redeemer. He is my savior. He is my guide. He is my peace. He is my joy. He is my comfort. And he is my God. And he and he rules my life.